If you follow me on social media, then you know that I recently purchased a magical butter straining contraption. Before I can make a video of that, first I have to make some cannabis butter. What better way to make cannabis butter to try out the magical butter's new contraption than the magical butter machine itself? And this isn't just any magical butter machine. This is a first generation magical butter machine. After this one, they came out with the MB2. And when I was looking at their website, they now have an MB2E. And I don't know how all that stuff compares but I do know that this one is almost 10 years old and it does still work. The fact that this still works after a decade is truly impressive and in my opinion equally impressive in addition to being able to find the machine itself. I still have the instruction manual. When this magical butter machine came out it was an absolutely revolutionary gadget. Anyone who follows this channel knows that I am a big fan of making cannabis butter. It's a super stinky process and it takes forever and there's all this cleanup duty. This machine right here revolutionized that whole process. In addition to containing like all the smell in the contraption itself, it also has a self-cleaning function. Hold this a little bit closer to take a look. The functionality of this device is pretty well explained by just looking at the top of this. It has an oil function, butter function, a tincture function, and you just have the eight hour function if you just want to just prepare stuff for an extra long time for some extra strength goodness. And as I said, it's got a cleaning function on there. If I remember correctly, you just throw some soap and water in there and hit the cleaning function and it does its thing. It's basically three parts if you count the cord pull it apart here so this bottom part really reminds me of kind of a crock pot that is shaped like something that would hold coffee I worked banquet staff at some places for a little bit. I think they were called carafes or something. I can't remember what they were called, but they were coffee warming devices. Kind of reminded me of this. They didn't have tops on it like this though. So in addition to the easy push button functionality, it has this blender type functionality. And as I'm gonna do here in a minute, take eight grams of these bee buds, throw them in there, take two cups of butter, throw it in there. Minimum batch is two cups. Throw this on there, plug it in, hit the butter function. It'll start warming up and there's gonna be all these lights looking all pretty and fancy up top here. But one thing that I always forget about, I'll have this sitting on my kitchen counter or out, in this case, it's gonna go out in my garage for a while. Every so often, I can't remember how many minutes it is, like 15 minutes or something, that blender function starts spinning, scares the hell out of me every time. I have not tried the new machine, so I can't speak for those. And I don't think that you could get this first generation one anymore, but I've always been a fan of magical butter. It really makes the process of making butters, oils, and tinctures way, way easier. Since this magical butter machine came out there's a whole host of other devices I don't know how well they work but I'll say that this magical butter machine provided a lot of tasty joy over the years and with no further delay let me get this process started I apologize for the poor lighting I'm out here in my garage where this thing's gonna spin without scaring me but as you can see that's two cups of butter and roughly eight grams of the enchanted salad one thing I like about the Magical Butter Machine is it's pretty huge. You can make pretty large batches of it. Like I said, the smallest batch is two cups. You can make as much as five cups in a single go. For this one, we're just gonna do two. Forgot about that thing. I'll turn this light off so you folks can see one of the coolest features of this. So once you select the temperature and select the duration, it's an LED effect. Reminds me of my laptop. Whereas my laptop's only like a year old. This thing's a decade old. Still going. Well, that's it for this video. For the next video, we will be straining this stuff using the Magical Butter's new contraption. Catch you then. That's the sound that it makes, and it's every, like, five minutes. I was out here in my garage taking a bong hit, and it almost scared me to death. Carry on.